3. Possibility of theology. The possibility of theology has a threefold ground, 1. In the existence of a God who has relations to the universe, 2. In the capacity of the human mind for knowing God and certain of these relations, and 3. In the provision of means by which God is brought into actual contact with the mind, or in other words, in the provision of a revelation. Any particular science is possible only when three conditions combine, namely, the actual existence of the object with which the science deals, the subjective capacity of the human mind to know that object, and the provision of definite means by which the object is brought into contact with the mind. We may illustrate the conditions of theology from Selenology, the science, not of lunar politics, which John Stuart Mill thought so vain a pursuit, but of lunar physics. Selenology has three conditions, one, the objective existence of the moon, two, the subjective capacity of the human mind to know the moon, and three, the provision of some means, e.g., the eye and the telescope, by which the gulf between man and the moon is bridged over, and by which the mind can come into actual cognizance of the facts with regard to the moon.